I'm Dr. Rajendra Prasad, neuro and spine surgeon at Apollo Hospital, in the Prasad Apollo Hospital, Delhi. I want to introduce my patient, Raymond, who's here. He's come from Tanzania and he is 16 years old. And for the last several years, almost uh, 10 years, his spine has been curved. And this is an illness called scoliosis. Now in scoliosis, the whole spine is curved. The chest is collapsed on one side in severe scoliosis because the spine is so curved that uh, on one side the lung had collapsed. Um, he was walking so curved that he had to support his head. You will see that he, when he sits, he holds his head, supports his neck on one side. So he was going on like this and then somebody, um, he lives in a, in a remote part of Tanzania. There are some um, foreign tourists they happened to see him and over the last several years saw him get worse. And so they wanted to help him. They got in touch with me at Apollo Hospital and said, can you correct this spine deformity? Because how can this man, young boy, carry on the rest of his life so curved that he can barely walk straight? So it was difficult and I and my orthopedic spine colleague, um, Dr. Harsh Bhargav, we planned his surgery. The spine has been corrected as much as possible without risk. We did take all the precautions necessary and in places like Oporo where all the latest monitoring equipment was available. So in theatre, we had monitors so we could monitor electrical conduction from the leg to the brain, from the brain to the leg. So all that monitoring was going on while operating. So if something had gone wrong, I would have been warned during surgery that stop, don't do this something wrong is happening. So I want to thank him, in particular his family, for the confidence they, they had at, in Apollo Hospital. Obviously, we've had 20 years of experience of treating Tanzanian patients. That probably did help. He got good feedback. Um, and then the donors who came forward and said, listen, this man cannot go to the, any Western hospital. It will be five times as expensive Let's find the best place where he can be given the best treatment possible. And I'm happy to say it was here. And I'm happy to say that it was a, such a team effort. Me, the orthopedic team, the nurses in theatre, the nurses in ICU, the paediatricians. So correcting an illness like scoliosis, like he is, a curved spine, is major, major surgery, major risks involved, and it requires a huge team and I'm fortunate that I have that team here at Apollo so we could take it on. Naitwa Monica Daudi, nina miaka 28 ni mtanzania. Nipo huku India nilimleta mdogo wangu kwa ajili ya matibabu. Nilikuwa mepinda utwa mgongo. Kwa sasa ni anaendelea vizuri, ni amepona kabisa. Kwa kweli nawashukuru madokta wa huku tangu nije wamemhudumia vizuri mdogo wangu wametupokea vizuri naona ni fla yangu ni kubwa sana na mshukuru sana sana dokta kwa kumtibu mdogo wangu ni kwamba kwa sasa hali yake ni nzuri na yupo poa kabisa anaweza kusimama sasa hivi anatembea ni kwamba sina zaidi sina mengi cha ya kuongea na mshukuru sana dokta tena sana sina cha ku cha kuongezea zaidi ya pale ni kwamba mdogo wangu tangu alipozaliwa alikuwa na malazi ya utu wa mgongo ulikuwa umepinda kwa hiyo sisi kama sisi tulijua kwamba ni haitowezekana hatopona kabisa tulipofika India tumepokelewa vizuri dokta katupokea vizuri kaanza kumtibu mdogo wangu kwa hiyo kwa sasa hivi amepona kwa kweli hospitali inatibu na ina madokta wazuri wanaweza kwa hiyo tuendelee wa Tanzania ukiwa na, na mgonjwa wa aina yoyote huku kunawezekana kuna uwezekano madokta wanatibu vizuri sana mimi nashukuru sana mdogo wangu kwa hali alionao sasa hivi yupo vizuri Hello, my name is Raymond, Raymond Devde, or Daudi. I'm from Tanzania, Singida. So, I'm coming here, or, oh, Likuja Uku, 
pale ngo moja nikupata matibabu na matibabu nimeshapata uzuri nimefanikiwa kupona namshukuru Mungu kwa sasa naendelea vizuri kesho naweza kuondoka ah ile kuja huku siwezi kutembea vizuri niko na matatizo ya uto mgongo na chafu ah nilipokuja nilia nilia nili nilianza nifanyie operation na kweli nimefanyiwa ila nilipokuja walianza uchunguzi kwanza x-ray kama na mengine mengi nilifanya hivyo kwa muda alafu nikaja kufanywa mazoezi na nikafanywa operation um, operation nilifanywa tarehe shanga shanga yes shanga nilifanywa pili ya kwanza ya pili na hapo nikaja nikafanywa sasa na ndele vizuri kweli ni jambo la kumshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu kwa sababu sikutegemea kama ningeweza kutembea like this so i'm very happy for now and then namshukuru doctor Prasad my doctor for operation mm amen said ya sana yapo sina cha kukumbuka so thank you very much god bless you asante sana <laughs> and uh, nawashukuru wote ndio jitoa kwa moyo kumchangia kuja huku india kwa sababu nawashukuru sana sina cha kuwalipa but mungu atawalipa thank you very much for everyone alo toa na mbaya kutoa. Aloomba kwa Mungu nifanikiwe. Asante sana.